Hi everybody, this is day 15 of 31 days to radically changing your prayer life. Pastor Ed Taylor of Faith and Victory Church here, and isn't it amazing? We're already at the halfway point, and I will bet that you've already seen a significant change in your prayer life as you've been taking these different lessons and applying to your time in prayer with God. Today we're talking about praying with groanings of intercession. Paul wrote to the church at Rome in chapter 8 verse 26 and said that we pray with groanings which cannot be uttered in articulate speech. You see, when the Holy Spirit comes in the spirit of intercession, we begin to cry out for others in a way that's beyond our own ability or knowledge. We might be praying for people we don't even know around the world somewhere, but the Spirit knows. And He begins to join with our spirit and cry out with groanings you cannot utter in articulate speech as He prays out the will and purpose of the Father for that individual or for that group of people. So remember, yield yourself to the Holy Ghost. And if you have these earnings, yearnings and groanings coming out of you, go ahead and yield to that because it's the Holy Ghost wanting to use you to pray for somebody else. So today, we're going to yield ourselves and avail ourselves to the Holy Ghost to be able to pray with groanings of intercession. Join me tomorrow for day 16. And until then, be yielded to the spirit of groaning with intercession.